how the raw, living foods lifestyle can heal. Before we continue with the video, don't forget to kindly click the subscribe button below and click the bell icon below to be notified when we upload new material. Raw foods are living foods that have never been heated past 118 degrees. Because they have never been heated, they retain all their nutrients and enzymes. They are based on unprocessed, uncooked and often organic plant foods. Raw foods and living foods both contain enzymes, but the enzyme count is much higher in living foods due to the sprouting process which means to soak in water. The sprouting process removes enzyme inhibitors for easier digestion. Anne Wigmore was a Lithuanian-American holistic health practitioner and raw food advocate. She developed the Living Foods Lifestyle in Boston, Massachusetts in 1970, and she believed that there are two main causes of disease and disorder, toxemia and deficiency. Toxemia is blood poisoning caused by bacterial substances in the blood. These poisons or toxins are caused by eating processed, unnatural and pesticide-tainted foods. Toxins in the blood are also caused by unhealthy stress in the body. Deficiency means insufficiency in the body or undernourishment in the body due to the lack of nutrients in indigestible cooked foods. The Living Foods Lifestyle is an alternative approach to life and health. The Living Foods Lifestyle consists of foods such as nuts, seeds, grains, sprouts, fruits, vegetables and sea vegetables that have not been heated above 118 degrees. Thousands of people have found enormous benefit in healing by incorporating living foods into their lives. People adopt this lifestyle to promote optimal health, for weight loss, to increase mental clarity, and to slow the aging process. Living foods also help to increase energy and well-being, improve chronic and degenerative diseases, and detoxify the body from internal and external toxins. The easiest way to lose weight on any diet program is to decrease the amount of calories consumed. Raw vegetables and greens have the fewest calories of any food, with fruits following a close second. These foods have high water content and a load of nutrients, which makes them easier to digest and dispel. When eating foods this high in nutrients, your hunger decreases and your cravings subside. Raw foods can aid in slowing the aging process. Aging is the phenomenon that everyone will eventually have to deal with. Raw foods are filled with enormous amounts of nutrients, vitamins, minerals and fiber. A body that is filled with an abundance of nutrients will age slowly. The nutrients from the food strengthen the bones, boost the immune system and promote healthy skin. The foods are low in toxins and are free from carcinogens, so the body does not have to work as hard to stay healthy. Fibers in raw foods keep the digestive system healthy and viable. Aging is always characterized by the loss of energy in the body. One of the adverse effects of aging is the slowdown of the digestive process, resulting in a host of illnesses. Within one week of people on the raw food diet, people have reported a noticeable sharpness in mental clarity. When it comes to nutrients for the brain, all foods are not created equally. Foods that are very high in nutrients aid in optimal performance of the brain. A high plant diet can help you feel more alert, rejuvenate the nervous system and protect against neurodegeneration, which is a loss of function of neurons. Finally, the living foods lifestyle can help detoxify the body internally and externally. To detoxify means to remove potentially harmful substances from the body. When toxins are tucked inside your cells, they interfere with the cellular chemistry and decrease the body's energy production. When toxins exit the cells, they attack the nerves which causes irritation. When toxins are expelled, symptoms range from cravings, fatigue, irritability, and physical pains. The body usually craves the most toxic foods until the proper nutrients have been incorporated into the system. Similarly, cravings are akin to smokers and or alcoholics, 